He gets cut. He he he, uh, he annoyed me a little bit when he was playing it. Because being a dude that likes puzzles and stuff like that, puzzle games, it just kind of annoyed me that he didn't really strategize or think about what he was doing sometimes. But I'm not him. He played the game the way he wanted to play. And I can't really criticize him for it, and I'm not going to. <laughs> I liked the ending he got. And yes, he uh, got the... See Catherine as the title um, ending, which is pretty cool. I thought that was funny. The only other walkthrough so far that I've seen is by this other dude, and the game's in Japanese. I have nothing against people from Japan. I have nothing against anime that's in Japanese. I just prefer. Oh, hey, look! I'm guessing that is Dad from uh, what he's saying and that cool little necklace. It looks pretty cool. Anyways, yeah. He played that game. It's also made by Atlas. Looks pretty cool. If I had the money, I'd go play it. Unfortunately, I don't. Oh, excuse me. I'm not even sure if you can hear me that well. This is just a test anyways. I'll show y'all later more videos, but this mic kind of sucks. Most mics with Xbox do if they're just the 20 bucks. Just the uh, cheap ones, which is the ones I usually get. I've had three so far. They last a while, and then they break. But back to Catherine and my what I was originally gonna say. Um, yeah, it's good. What I liked about it more than just the puzzles, puzzles were cool. Was it that that the anime backstory, the story was like awesome. Other than that, I've only played that I know of one other game besides this from uh, Atlas which is uh... Oh, he said to call you said for you to call him Big Brother alright I haven't played this game in a while. Besides earlier when I was testing the uh, ROM out to see if it worked. Even though it kind of made my stuff go bad, which is a little bit stupid, but anyways. Um, it works. I'm going to play with this. I got a new capturing software, so I'm going to be using that for this. Mm, I'm using a bunch of different stuff. I'm trying to get it to work, and I... Uh, got my internal crap working for the computer earlier as well, so it should be recording the music through the computer itself and not just the microphone. Because because of that, I was having a horrible time with the audio. Then... Something's up ahead. <clears throat> and I haven't seen very many videos of this. If I could get more stuff, if I had a better computer, I'd be doing GameCube stuff. I'd be doing a bunch of stuff. I got recently just a friend of another friend who's now my friend, oddly enough, who has an actual DVD recorder. It'd be cool if I could get it, but he's not going to let me do that, seeing as how I think it was a gift or something from a friend. Anyways, that's... I'm not just going to take stuff from other people. I don't really do that unless it's there. Unless... Hmm. 
know how to put it. I don't really like taking stuff from other people unless they give me the permission and I have an actual right to be able to use it. That's the way I am. So somebody's over there. Uh, that used to be the direction of my old house. You can press the B button and run, or you can just spin around in circles. I am gonna over here. So basically, this game is about magic, and what well, you'll see later. I'll uh, go ahead and see this this choice right here changes your game entirely. You have four choices: the mechanoid soldier, the only child. Devil Girl or the Half Beast. When I first played through the game, I got the Devil Girl. You have to play through the game four times. I'm just saying what I know. Because I, I honestly don't know very much about it. I didn't even... I played through the game and the story pretty much stays the same except with the people you... with the person you choose. Their story is going to change because it's not going to be the same person. But anyways, uh, sticking to what I did play, because I really enjoyed and it had funny parts, um, I'm going to go ahead and pick Devil Girl, just because. Uh, from what I've read, um, the Mechanoid Soldier is uh, good for distance attacking, I think. Kind of different. The only child is like nature-ish. Uh, the Devil Girl, I'm not exactly good at remembering what exactly she does, but, well, I know some of the things she does, but attacking-wise, I'm not quite sure. And the Half Beast, I honestly don't know, never played with these people. So, here she goes! Interesting. Sephiroth. It's a devil. Why is it here? Mm, I'm gonna ask you a question right here and now. I'm just gonna sit down my controller. Would you mind if I did voices as, uh, you know, different voices? Because that's what I tend to do, but some people will get agitated by that, and I'm just, uh, yeah, so I'll let you choose what you want me to do, I'll play the game as normal, <coughs> I'll talk as normal for the most part, but I might change voices every now and then, it's just my, uh, personality, anyways, let's continue. Keep my guard up. Monster. What? That... I don't think it like that. Oh my god. A rabbit with striped ears. And it's my first fight. Alright, quick tutorial. Ah, uh, that's guard. Move right, move left. You can jump. Anyways, you guard with B, you uh, attack with A. That's one of the coolest parts about this game. I accidentally, if you saw, I accidentally pressed the right trigger on my controller, which I have mapped to speed up. And the left trigger is to save state, because usually games like this don't really work too well. Uh, what do I want? Since I'm a guy of balance, I prefer to have everything evened out. You can choose how you want to play, I play the way I play, play. Anyways, yes, are you alright? Are you okay? I'm fine, I don't know what you're talking about. 